In today's video, I'm going to be giving you a full step-by-step -step tutorial on how you can use Pump.Fun to trade Solana meme coins. Now, this video is going to cover everything you need to know, including how to get set up on Pump.Fun, and also how to find the best coins that have potential to pump. Now, the first thing you need to do is just head over to the website Pump.Fun, and from there, we need to connect our wallet. So we need to scroll to the top of the screen, and we need to go to the top right corner and click Connect Wallet. From there, it's going to ask which wallet we want to connect, I'll be choosing Phantom, but you want to choose whichever wallet you use. However, since this is on Solana, most people will be using Phantom. So we can simply select this. I can then choose to connect my wallet by clicking connect. And now that our wallet's connected, we can start editing our profile. So from here, we have the option to edit our profile and we can add a profile picture, change our username, and we can also add a bio. So once you've entered in a bio, you can click save and you can close out of that and your account's now been created as you can see in the top right corner. So from here, you are going to have to have some Solana in your wallet. As you can see in the top right corner, I've got 0.45 Solana in my wallet. So that is enough that I can trade with. However, if you don't have any money in your wallet, what I recommend you do is simply to send some over to this wallet. And once you've actually funded that wallet with some Solana, we're now ready to trade coins. So to start with, you want to be on this terminal section over here. And we want to first select this sort button and we want to actually change this to creation time. We can then go over to order and we want to make sure this is on descending and this now means whenever a new coin is created it will now be shown as the first option. Now I've got my show animations off which is why this is not updating but you can turn it on if you want to be notified every time a new coin is created. But for the sake of this video I'm just going to leave it off so that those animations don't keep popping up. So now that we can see all the coins that have been created recently how do we go about picking the right one? So as you can see I'm on deck screener right here and I've sorted the coins by trending in the last 24 hours. And what you want to do from here is actually look for some sort of meta. And to be honest, to be successful with this, you do have to have some sort of understanding of memes. If you've been following crypto or markets in general recently, you would have seen the stuff going on with GME. And if you look at all these coins at the top, they're pretty much all related to that. So you have to essentially find coins that are related to that, that have potential to do well. And for example, this is probably a good one, short GameStop, because it's related to GameStop and it is currently a low market cap. Now the meta does change all the time, so as I said earlier, you do have to have some sort of understanding of memes and how Solana coins work. Because if you just bought a random coin like this for example, it's probably not going to do well, and it's probably not going to have much demand. So let's just say I did want to buy this short GameStop one. Now this isn't guaranteed to do well, because most of the coins on Pump.Fun don't succeed. However, if this is related to the current meta, it has got a chance to succeed. So what we want to do is click on it. And if we do like the look of it, we like the narrative, we can go ahead and buy some of the coins. And we can do that by going up to this buy tab at the top. And then we can choose how much Solana we want to buy. So let's just say I wanted to buy a tiny amount, 0.01. I can type that in here and I can simply click place trade. We can also add a comment if we want, but I'm just going to go ahead and place a trade. From there, we see our phantom wallet come up and it's saying that we can swap our Solana and we will receive this coin. So I'm going to go ahead and click confirm. And as you can see, the transaction has now been confirmed and we've successfully bought this coin on pump.fun. So we can see down here exactly how this works and how this will end up on Radium. So it says here when the market cap reaches almost $60,000, all the liquidity will be deposited into Radium and it will be burned. So as you can see, the market cap currently is 4000 and there isn't actually much demand at the moment. So this might not be the best coin to buy. But if this did reach $60,000 in market cap, it would basically get taken off of pump.fun and we can now trade it on radium like how we would normally buy coins. If they end up on radium and they carry on to succeed, that's how they become a top coin like all of these ones you're seeing on screen now. Now you do have to keep in mind that most of these coins won't succeed and that there's new ones being created on here pretty much every few seconds, so it is very saturated. If you're new to this, I wouldn't recommend you put tons of money into these coins as the chances are they won't succeed. However, if you do find a good coin that does succeed, it could end up like this. And if I look at how much this has gone up recently, I guarantee it's a crazy amount. As you can see, 85,000%. So the chances of finding something like this are really rare. However, it is possible. So let's just say we didn't like this coin anymore and we wanted to sell. What we could do is go to the sell tab instead. And we can actually just choose 100% so that we can sell all of our coins. So from here, we can click place trade. And we can also add a comment for selling, but I'm just going to click place trade. From there, we see our wallet pop up again, and we can just confirm it by clicking that. And the transaction has now been sent and will be confirmed in a second. So if we want to see all the coins that we've bought in the past so that we can check up on them, we can actually go to the top right corner and click view profile. 
And from there, we'll be able to see all the coins we hold, as well as our replies, notifications, and all this other stuff. However, this coins held tab will probably be most useful for you, as if you are buying tons of coins, you'll be able to track them on this section, and you can simply look for the coin you're looking for, and then go to view coin, and you'll get taken to this page. So this has been my video showing you how to use Pump.Fun to trade Solana meme coins. Remember, these coins are very risky, so if you're not 100% sure what you're doing, invest small amounts so that you can learn what works and what doesn't. And you also need to remember to buy these coins based on the current meta, because if you just buy random coins on here, you're pretty much guaranteed to lose all of your money. So I hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, please comment down below to say it helped you out. And also like and subscribe to see more content like this. Thanks for watching.